Good day everyone. I am Sister Yeye. Welcome to the 5 Wise Virgins Gospel TV channel where we share the gospel through animation. Sorry for the late update. A lot had been going on but thank God I am back by God grace. By God grace our message is about signs to know if he or she is the right spouse for you. I pray this message bless you all. Wow, thank God it's Friday. It's been a long weekend. What are you doing this weekend, princess? I am going for Friday service after work as usual, Irie. You are invited to our Friday service. It will be powerful, my dear Irie. I am not interested, princess. You too old school. Today is Friday, then you talking about church business. After a long week of working, it's time to for chilling, my dear friend. I will go to church on the Sabbath or Sunday. But tonight I am going to chill in the club with my home girls. Wow, Ryrie, you are a Christian, and you are always talking about chilling in the club, and on the Sabbath you take your Bible and go to church. I can I even preach to you when you knows the truth. I pray you will return back to the Lord soon before it's too late. I remember when we were children, how serious you were with the things of God. You had changed so much. Revelation 3, 3 Remember, therefore, what you have received and heard, hold it fast, and repent. But if you do not wake up, I will come like a thief, and you will not know at what time I will come to you. Revelation 3, 16 So then because thou art lukewarm, and neither cold nor hot, I will spew thee out of my mouth. Keep your preaching to yourself, this is why you will remain single. You think dressing like a old lady and going to church almost every day will give you a husband. At your age you don't even have a boyfriend. Me I am tired with this church, church business. The Lord will understand. He knows I love him. I will repent when I'm done. Anyway I don't think going to club to enjoy myself is a sin. Life is short, we need to enjoy ourselves. James 4, 4 he adulterers and adulteresses. Know ye not that the friendship of the world is enmity with God? Whosoever therefore will be a friend of the world is the enemy of God. Ryrie you cannot love God and love the world at the same time, we must be separated completely from the world as a true believer of Jesus Christ. I will continue to pray for you my dear friend and sister. Look princess we have a customer. Hey princess it's been a while, I just came back from the USA. You look good. Melvin. You just came here a few weeks ago. When did you travel to the USA? Anyway, welcome back to our store. What can I serve you today? Yes, the day I saw you all, I travel the next day for a business meeting. Happy to be back. I hope you are really to reply me about my proposal. I miss you, princess. I told I will pray about it. The Lord had not answered me yet. I'm still praying. I am hoping you answer me quickly because I am hungry for you. Can't wait for us to be tomorrow. You will enjoy me. You will not regret being my girlfriend. Did he just say girlfriend? This is a no sign for me. He wants me for girlfriend and not wife. He must be a playboy. Please help me Lord. What are you thinking on princess? Are you really to give me your answer? No, my dear Melvin. Just thinking on what you just said but in a deeper way. As I said I'm still praying about it. Not have anything to say concerning that right now. Okay I heard but don't take a longer time, because I don't have long time to wait for you. I don't know about that, anyway what are you buying here today? Customers are about to come in more because it's almost evening. Okay thanks for your time. Give me some rubbing alcohol, sunscreen hand wash and something for headache. Here is it. Thanks for shopping with us. Have a blessed day. Wow, princess that guy love you. He been asking you for relationship for a long time now. Why can't you give him a chance? Nowadays to find good man like this is hard and to make it more juicy he is rich and handsome. Hum, you call two months a long time. Anyway I am still praying and waiting for the Lord to answer me. As I discern, 
The guy is not ready for marriage, but wants to make me his girlfriend and be sleeping with me. And God forbid I can never defile myself for anything in this world. When time is right, God will send my husband. When he is talking, I can only hear him say I want you to be my girlfriend and not wanting me for a wife. That's a red flag for me. <laughs> you are funny princess, do you think boys still do that 1860 thing? To date girls without teasing them. No one buying pig in a bag anymore. You to be girlfriend first and marriage later. If you don't want that guy I will take him ooh. After all, he looks so good. Close your mouth girl, stop acting like a little girl. Are you serious with this you're remaining a virgin to get married? For me once I find someone who loved me and promised to marry me I am not waiting for marriage before testing the moo. After all we are not children anymore. 27 and not married yet, girl we are not getting younger ooh. Me I want to get married by next year. Wow Ryrie is this how you had gone lukewarm? You are willing to give your body and virginity to a man who is not your husband. Hum. I think I will inform your mommy so we can strongly pray for you. This is serious and scary. Those girls you follow nowadays are really misleading you. Rari please think before you make a big mistake that you will regret for the rest of your life. Leave that thing girl, please if you try and tell my mom anything. I will deal with you. Please leave our parents out of this. We are not children anymore but we are grown adults. I am old enough to make my own decisions and know what is best for me. Ryrie I love you, we are more than friends. I will continue to tell you the truth and pray for you. I will not give up on you. I continue to trust God for you to return back to him. Amen my religion friend and sister. Few hours later. Riri went at the club with her friends and see what happened next. Let us check on Princess in a bit. Lord please take over my life and allow only your way to be done. I pray that your mercy speak for me and my family. I pray that your mercy locate Ryrie and bring her back to you. I pray Lord if Melvin is the man for me please reveal him to me if not please give me signs. Take control over my life in Jesus Christ's name Amen. Thank you Lord Jesus Christ. Let me try and get some sleep to wake up for my quiet time to seek the Lord. I don't want to sleep during my quiet time. Most Christians find themselves sleeping while praying because they don't rest their body and have enough sleep. As humans our body need enough rest to give us physical and spiritual strength. I had been doing this for years. This enabled me to be awake and strong physically and spiritually on my prayer altar by God's grace. Let us go back to Riri and see her update. Riri was born in a Christian home. From her childhood she was walking with the Lord, but once she entered university and started following lukewarm Christians who believe God only look at the heart and what we do or live do not matter. She had gone deeper into the world and only the grace of God can bring her back to the Lord. But Princess is her childhood friend who keep advancing her and praying for her daily. As true Christians, let us continue to pray for our fallen brothers and sisters in the faith. What a night, life is good. When do you want to leave for home? For me I am enjoying myself tonight. Tomorrow I am not going anywhere, I will get enough sleep. 
I will not be here too long. I have to go to service in the morning because if I don't my parents will be calling me and find out why I am not in service. My parents are so religious, this get to me. I don't want them to ask princess about me because she is surely going to tell them the truth. She is my problem.